Iron deficiency anemia and its direct link to pica behavior. Why do I crave ice? Patient presentation. 1. Patient, 35-year-old female. 2. Chief complaint. Fatigue, weakness, and an unusual craving for ice. 3. Medical history, reports heavy menstrual periods. 4. Exam findings, pale conjunctiva, brittle nails, spoon-shaped nail beds, coilinichia. 5. Lab results. Hemoglobin, 9 grams DL, low. Hematocrit, 27%, low. Ferritin, 12 nanograms per milliliter, low. MCV, 70 fluid, low. Iron deficiency is one of the most common nutritional deficiencies in the world. According to the World Health Organization, WHO, it is a significant public health issue affecting both developing and developed countries. Estimates suggest that nearly 25% of the world's population is anemic, much of which is due to iron deficiency. In the United States, iron deficiency is most prevalent among young children and women of childbearing age, particularly those who are pregnant or have heavy menstrual periods. According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention CDC, about 9% of toddlers aged 1-2 years and 7-9% of women aged 12-49 years are iron deficient. Iron deficiency can have significant health impacts, including impaired cognitive function in children, increased susceptibility to infection, and increased maternal and child mortality rates. 1. Facts about pica and iron deficiency anemia. Direct connection. Pica, specifically pagophagia, is directly related to iron deficiency, and resolving the deficiency can also resolve the pica. Menstrual blood loss. Heavy menstrual periods are a common cause of iron deficiency anemia in women of reproductive age. Correction of pica, iron supplementation to treat the iron deficiency anemia often leads to a disappearance of pica symptoms. Impact on daily life, both conditions can have a profound impact on the quality of daily life, affecting energy levels and overall health. Dental complications, the act of chewing ice can lead to dental problems like enamel erosion. Lab diagnostics. Iron deficiency is often evidenced by low levels of hemoglobin, hematocrit, and ferritin in lab tests. Treatment plan. Oral iron supplementation is the typical first step in treating iron deficiency anemia. Psychoeducation. Patients may not be aware that their cravings for non-food items are related to a medical issue and may benefit from education. Importance of diet. A balanced diet rich in iron can assist in preventing iron deficiency anemia. Full recovery. Iron deficiency anemia can take several months to correct, depending on the severity. Consult a specialist. For severe cases, consultation with a hematologist may be necessary. High prevalence. Iron deficiency anemia is one of the most common nutritional deficiencies worldwide, making its symptoms highly relevant for medical professionals to recognize. Summary. This case underscores the direct link between iron deficiency anemia and pica, particularly the craving for ice, pagophagia. Both medical and nursing students should be adept at diagnosing and managing these interconnected conditions to offer holistic patient care. For more information, for additional details on pica and iron deficiency anemia, please consult reputable medical sources such as PubMed, medical textbooks, and the World Health Organization guidelines.